Good consistency, oh, this is gonna be good. good morning, evening, afternoon, wherever you are in the world, free gang. We are coming to you live. But not oh, live. Hi. No, not live. From our front room, from the studio. That is the front room in London. As we are going to be doing a challenge today. Now, as you guys know, we did a 24 hour cereal challenge where we ate meals throughout the day that had cereal in them in some way. But after all of that, we have a lot of cereal left over and we need to know what to do with it. And one of you guys recommended, why don't we do a pizza cereal challenge? So we saw that and we thought, challenge accepted. So today, we've got the kids in here. We've got Jamie, we've got Jojo, and these guys are gonna make cereal themed pizzas. So yes, it's another kid versus teen. As you know with things like this it takes a lot of time to set up so luckily we have a magician here who can get this all sorted nice and quickly jojo do some magic please okay can you drive your kamala oh wow jojo good work good work yeah. well done good stuff why does jojo get to do all the magic you're a slytherin you can't be trusted you'd probably create a snake and they'd probably eat me so what we've got here is stop eating toppings <laughs> what we've got here we're going to go for a jam base and covered in all sorts of toppings if there's any left we've got chocolate to melt on there as well which can almost be like cheese melted on there i'll go through the toppings while you can still see them we've got the granola we've got the choco pops we've got the rice snaps the choco hoops jam the cookies multi-grain hoops frosted plates and chocolate this is going to be crazy they're going to make two pizzas each one's going to be for themselves and then they're going to make one each for me and katie which i don't know what this is going to be like but it's going to be fun no doubt are you guys ready to start ready steady go <laughs> that's just battling with spoons <laughs> Jamie's got one of the dollar. Nice. You've been eating your stop eating your base. <laughs> you know I'm all about the base. About the base. I'll put a bit more in there. Do you want to spread that out? The wand will not be needed. Jam doesn't spread quite the same as pizza sauce. Oh, no, this is right. oh, Jamie's a pro. Look at her. You've done this before, haven't you? Obviously. <laughs> when it comes to stuff like this, arts and crafts or food related, cooking, Jamie is a pretty serious person. You must get that from your mother actually. Good Jojo, let's get that big bit spread around. That's it nice and carefully. Good consistency, oh, this is Jamie. Gonna be good. Jamie's going for a first topping. We're going with the cocoa box. Look at the way she is delicately spreading this. So cocoa box, Jamie, is what your first topping is. It looks like you've gone for a half of them there. You're going for some sort of pattern. And Jojo, what have you got there? Are all of those hoops making it to the base or are they ending up finishing in your mouth? Oh, rice krispies now for Jamie. And so Jojo's adding some cocoa pops as well now to the choco hoops or choco pops are they called. Yeah, and Jamie, you're looking good over there as well. It's going to be down to you guys at the end of this as well to decide which one is your favourite. Whether it's going to be Jamie's or Jojo's. The hands are coming across and everything here. I love the cookies. Jamie very carefully deciding where to place her choco hoops. Oh, added a few more. You've gone back to the cocoa pop. I'm just, just like... making like a mess right now. Yes, I can see that mess, Jojo. It is just a random mess. Oh, a bit of granola's going on there. Okay. Oh, that's that's a game changer, that one. Oh, now multi-grain hoops for Jamie. <laughs> you just... He just grabs a handful and just, and just straight on top. Okay. Jamie's all calculated and everything. There must be exactly two centimetres between each hoop. Old Frosty Flakes, she's put a bit on the side there, like that's a pile that she's accessing. She's made a localised pile, she's not just relying on the bowl. Oh, a bit of smoothening out process there. So anything that's been missed between the two of you, you actually have covered all, all of the toppings. However, we do have blocks of chocolate that can go on there if you want that to melt in. Your jaw seems to be moving, Jamie, what's that about? No. And there used to seem to be less toppings than there was earlier. Oh, she's going for the placing of the chocolate actually wedging the chocolate in to the jam to make sure it's safe absolutely still she's got these lots of jam on the edge of like balancing them on going back for a second helping of jam there i said oh she's putting another blob of jam <laughs> to nest another piece of chocolate there are you worried the chocolate's going to jump off itself or something <laughs> There, there is no, this is the thing, there doesn't seem any logic in how these are displayed though, they're just across the middle. What about I put like all the chocolate in the middle, so it melts and then it will like spread all down. There isn't any right like or wrong in this. A chocolate mountain. A chocolate mountain. These are all going in the oven as well, aren't they? <laughs> no, that's going to be like, what's the point in this? <laughs> Stop eating off your pizza. That's going to be for you to eat later. Mm -hmm. How are you doing, Jojo? Are you feeling that you've got enough? Don't just take the big chocolate and eat it. Oh, a nice little side pump. <laughs> That's just for you to snack on now, isn't it? It's not even going on the pizza. 
Just sound of them eating. <laughs> no sound of them actually doing anything. So I just commentate on them eating. Yeah. I don't know what they are. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we thinking guys? Are we close to completion? No. You can't have garnish around the side of it. <laughs> Cereal garnish. Oh my god, you're taking this well seriously. Remember you've got a second pizza you're going to be doing and that's going to be for me and mummy. Don't waste all of your ideas and energy on this one. You've got to have some backup ideas. Speaking of which, who would want to do whose? Who wants to do mine? Who wants to do mummy's? I want to do daddy's. They both picked me. I get to do daddy. Okay, is that right? You do mummy's then? <laughs> Look at how Jamie is plating this so carefully. Can I have a little jam? Jam. This was all nice. Stop eating this stuff. I can just hear her snacking in my ear. <laughs> right, 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 right. Right. Where do you want it? Like, oh, around here. Mm. Yeah. You won't help him. I'm not, I'm not helping him. He asked for it. It's just... Don't matter. You're still ten if Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. You both were so eager to make mine. That's maybe not a good thing. <laughs> like they want to punish me. I'm not happy there are two bite marks from your dough, Jojo, from your base. I guess I'll cover them with cereal. Let's fill them with a multi grain. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's the best. Oh, that, that, those are Disqualified. I don't get disqualified. I'm the one in charge. Mm. So, what are we thinking, guys? Are we close to completion of pizza number one? Like the side, it's more than this side. It's all jammed. I like how you've got the like the dark and the light either side. I should the yin and the yang. I should have tried doing actual yin and yang and the actual shape of yin and yang. Oh, so next one, there you go, the next one. Put some more jam on there, oh, yeah, and put more jam in the mouth as well. This is like the one piece of fruit amongst all of this. No, there's nothing. There's nothing. Oh, there's a dry, there's a banana chip. I want it. So what are we doing? Are we, we're still doing toppings, really. You. <laughs> She's just making a part to eat herself. Okay. Jojo, what are you thinking? I think I might be done. You think you're done? You're done as well? You're, done, you're not done snacking? No, clearly not. This is not a buffet. I think we should go in and have a closer look at what these guys have got. But Jamie's is very, very balanced, very organised, very heavy on the chocolate one side, very heavy on the non-chocolate the other side. Yeah, very, very well organised. Good first effort, Jamie. You should be proud. Are these just to pick at? No, she's making the dish all just filling up an edge, see? Precision. Very important to her. As for Jojo, not so heavy on the precision, I would say. Creative nonetheless. Just an expression of you, just like, ah, just go for it, isn't it? But I like it though. So Jojo, we're gonna need your magic again, because we're gonna need to put these two in the oven and get the next two bases in to set up for the next pizza. So do you reckon you could do that for us? Mm -hmm. You got a spell up your sleeve? Oh yeah, there's one there. I'm gonna do the magic. Can you trust Jamie the Slytherin with your Harry Potter wand? So Jamie, very clearly and say, Ventravo and Mystelic. Ventravo and Mystelic. <laughs> you can do it, Jojo. Ventrabra and Mr. Lick's too much for her feeble Slytherin mind. <laughs> if it's not turning someone into a snake, I'm not interested. I did the voice of mouth one, I don't know why. Right, Jojo, take it away. Ventrabra Alistic. Hey, that's much better. Good. So nice and clean, clear. Are we all ready for the next one? So you're going to be doing one for me, yeah? Hmm. And Jojo, you're going to be doing one for Mummy. Oh, this is going to be nice, some nice creations. So, without further ado, whoa, 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 go! Jamie, there was a lot more calculated care the way you spread last time. Why are you doing it? Well, it's only for Bob, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to be scrutinising her so much now. Imagine she makes a pattern of a snake on her pizza. That'd be so Slytherin like. Oh, nice, Jojo. I'll clean in the spoon with your mouth as well, good. Jojo's gone in straight away for the chocolate hoops. And this is some serious placing. It's his mother on the line now, so he's making sure that he's placing it very, very carefully indeed. But look at this, placing all around the edge. I think you've learned a lesson from how well organized Jamie was, haven't you? Yeah. Nice, Jojo, looking good. And Jamie's going for the sprinkling of rice snaps. More of a spread, you're not looking for a pattern. Run to the yin and yang idea. Right here. I have to eat this. Yeah. Jojo, you are making some serious detailed pattern here. Oh, a smoothing hand is coming from Jamie. Oh, oh, pattern's emerging. Jojo, you're actually doing specific flakes. So some sort of pattern is emerging here with Jamie. She's doing a trail of cocoa pops at your end, which are being blocked by some cookies by the looks of it. It's kind of looking like a face. Jojo is putting on some cookies as well. Wow, yours is looking a cool pattern too. Are you doing some sort of symmetrical pattern there? Yeah, it is symmetrical. Never known these two to be so quiet, especially this one. I'm intrigued at what Jamie's is turning into. This is so serious. This is 
is unbelievable. It's like the first one felt like it was a warm up. Jamie's was really creative in the first time, and JoJo's was just like his own version of creativity. Because art is subjective, so there's no right or wrong. But this one is like a lot slower, a lot more calculated. It's like they've, they've learned some lessons from their first attempt, and now they're, they've taken it on to the next one. It's shown some growth, growth in toppings. Jamie has literally never been this silent in her life. Say something, Jamie, let me know you're okay. I'm not okay. We've got a face emerging here. Wow, some real good symmetry. This is really hard to keep on top of, guys, because there's so much going on both sides. I don't know where to look. Jamie has left the arena. Disqualification. Cut in chocolate. My God, she's gone next level. She's making an incision to the block of chocolate. What is this creation? We need to know. Suspense is getting the free game. We can't mm -hmm. handle anymore. You cut it into like triangular blocks. Can I please have some chocolate? More choco hoops. You guys are absolutely cane in the choco hoops. Jamie's just, oh, you're chopping up choco hoops as well. <laughs> My God, the effort going into this is astounding. I commend it. No. Oh, don't throw choco pops at me. Sorry. It's all right. Sorry, Judge. Sorry, Judge. Yeah, no, you're scared. Referee. Referee. I'm oh, no, Judge Dread. I like that. I didn't have all the law. I had the law. So, Jojo, you're deciding to place Coco Pops inside Choco Hoops. That is a brave move, I must say. I feel that your one is looking back at me, Jamie. I think I'm doing a little better. Oh, what did you say about that, Jamie? Some trash Do talking one. going on here, eh? Don't insult each other's mums because that's the same person. He's struggling, really struggling to get these Coco Pops into the Choco Hoops because they keep entering his mouth. I'm so intrigued with what you are chopping these up for. You've got these which look exactly the same, the same. as what you were chopping up. It's mm. not the same. It's totally different. You don't understand. Jojo, I feel, is creating a key to unlock another dimension. And Jamie is what's going to be in that other dimension looking back at us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, this is taking too long. Come on, tell me what's going on here. It's a cereal grid. A cereal grid. Oh my god, we could end up entering a cereal dimension here. Everything is made of cereal. <laughs> Are you? What is this? I'm making shavings of chocolate. <laughs> oh, that's quite a good idea though, because then you can get more even spreads to get a nice melty thing over the top. I'm not a cereal pizza expert to actually have any idea of what I'm talking about, but I'm just guessing here. How's the shaving going along, Jamie? You just ground a piece of chocolate into dust. <laughs> She's so like ridiculously serious. I even feel that even this is only a bit of every box. We're going to have a lot of cereal still left over. And I'm thinking we may even have to do other creative challenges with them. Like, maybe you guys could help us out as well. Comment below what other cereal related challenges could we do? We could be going all year on it. So how is the chocolate dust coming along? Is it worth all of that cutting up? Yeah and you're sprinkling it all over here. What is going on here? What? I can't even see where it's added. <laughs> Come on guys, this was fun a bit ago. This has become a tense competition, I must say. I feel like you guys could go forever doing this. What is the point in scribing a word into a block of chocolate that's going to melt? Okay. So let's have a close up look of what you guys have done. So Jojo, you've done a tremendous symmetrical pattern here. All sorts of designs and everything. I definitely think this could be the key to unlocking another cereal related dimension. So Jojo, are you happy with what you did? Mm -mm. You've done this for mummy as well, so I'm sure she's gonna enjoy this. Very nice on the eye, especially. Over to Jamie's as she snacks on additional <laughs> toppings. Jamie's, your creation went on for a long, long time and it looks like it's paid off. So you seem to have made the face of what seems to be some sort of creature from a cereal dimension. However, when we zoom in closer on this block, we can reveal it's a certain person. Comment below if you can figure who out who that is. But very, very creative, Jamie. The glasses and everything. The detail you went in to make those higher up and the eyeballs and everything. Although, Harry seems to be missing the nose. You can't even smell how good he tastes. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Last edition, there's a nose. So you've both done amazingly. I'm really, really proud of your creation. And that that you took this time, you put this time in, you, it's really paid off. So Jojo, we're going to need some magic again, because the idea is we've got to get these ones into the oven and get the other ones out of the oven into here. Do you reckon you can conjure up something? We need you guys to taste test the first pieces. Well, to make sure they're not poisonous, you guys can eat the second one. Exactly, you're our canaries. Okay. From you gone, Zamavi! Yes! Oh wow, cool. These are looking very nice. Are you ready, guys, to have a taste test? Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Yeah, they're getting there, they're getting there. You've gone for the big chocolatey side. Oh, right, wow, the chocolate on the end as well. Look at that. Thank so you. look at that, there's Jamie's one. Very chocolatey, very jammy. Please, do us the honours. You know she was never going to have a problem with this. So casual, like, yeah, I eat this all day. What are you saying, Jamie? It's weird. <laughs> A good weird though, right? Weird though. You like it, don't you? Okay, should we go over to yours, Jojo? The whole pizza's come apart, Jojo. Mm. So this is Jojo's. Bit of chocolate on the end there, covered in all sorts of stuff. This was the crazy first attempt. You ready to give it a go? Bit hesitant there, were you? Mmm. <laughs> what do you reckon? Nice. I hear Jamie munching around behind me here. Jamie, you got their rice stuck in. Do you like it? It's nice, is it? Coming in jam, cereals, what more could you want? So guys, I'd love to know as well, what do you think? Who do you think is better out of these two? So you've got Jojo's, which is all toppings everywhere. Jamie's more calculated, she's insisting it's hers. Jojo, you're not messing around, you're getting straight stuck in both of you. Good work, guys. I'm impressed. I'm excited to uh, test our ones. But are you happy with how it tastes? Mm. Yeah? Mmm, 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 mmm. It's not really a good sign. So you've tasted yours, you can carry on eating yours, but Jojo, we're gonna need a bit more magic because we need to get rid of you two and these pizzas and get me and Mummy here with our pizzas that you've made. I can't finish my slice. Magic waits for no one, right, I'll give it a go. I wanna do it. Jamie, you give it a go. Bob smells. Didn't appear to work, that one. Damn it. Try another one. Jojo smells. That still one doesn't work. Jamie is amazing. Hi. Mummy, hello. Doing it. I've come to test my pizza. Yeah, you've got a good pizza to cut into there. It looks like whatever slice you take, you'll get a bit of everything. I like this magic. Mmm. It turns out what, that when Slytherins do say nice things, good stuff happens. I feel bad though that if I'm cutting into my pizza, I'm going to be cutting into a face. So do you want to go first? Or should I? I've got it in my hand. I'll go. Here we go. I can see where the rice snaps are brown slightly. Not bad. Want to have a go? Mm. Reminds me of my childhood. What sort of childhood did you Did you do one of these on camera when you were young? I didn't even have YouTube back then. Something about the, the jam and bread really stands out. The, yeah, especially the when dough. the bread's kind of um, yeah. cooked and crispy. Yeah, and then just the other stuff just even adds something even more special. You want to get into yours? Oh, look at that. Yeah. Good, yep. Mmm, <laughs> this is good. Do I go? I don't know if I want to share it with you. How oh, oh. dare you? All right, all right, go on then. Do Lady in the Tramp style. Mm. I'll be honest, I didn't think that eating this would be something that I enjoyed. Not at all, but I do actually enjoy it. It kind of, it works, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, all right. Yeah, don't eat my one. The chocolate didn't like completely melt, did it? No, it's quite thick chocolate and you can't completely burn everything else just to melt it, can you? Yeah, it just kind of stayed in where it in its place. Oh, oh do you know what this would be nice with? Cup of tea. Cup of tea. Yeah. I'm gonna eat mine with a cup of tea, I think. Me too. Right guys, so we've got all of the pizzas here. All of these are lovely. It's hard for me and Katie to choose which one we think is best. They're really tasty, aren't they? Let's be fair. Yeah, we can't decide anyway. We can't choose between our kids. No. We can't take favourites, can we? No. You can if you really wanted to. Yeah, I'm sure you would say that. <laughs> so we'd love to hear what you guys think. Who do you think was best? Who do you think won this challenge? Jojo or Jamie, the kid or the team? Leave your comments below. And also as well, let us know if you think there are any other fun challenges you would like to see with cereal. We've got a lot of it to go, so leave your comments below what fun ideas. I'm really excited to see what you guys are going to say what we could do with this. But before we end this video, I've got some shout outs to some of you lovely people who have been requesting them. So shout outs to Taylor May Drury, Aaron Wayne TV, Macy Murgatroyd, and the last shout out is coming from Jojo. Shout out to Arlo. Yes, Arlo, who is six years old. Your mother, Liza Morricom, asked for a shout out because you really enjoy watching Jojo's videos. If any of you guys ever want shout outs, leave them in the comments below and we'll get to them in the next few videos. And if you're new to this channel and you're enjoying fun challenges or any of our family vlogs, we'd love it if you subscribed. If you're already subscribed though, hit that notification bell and you'll be kept up to date on when we do upload videos. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Bye. Cereal.